Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I say that every time, don't I? Anyway, so in the studio, last night I went ahead and got the next level put on and then I got it foamed. This is the foam that we got left uh, to go. And then I went and got my little kit here that I use. I'm just waiting for the battery to charge. Um, I went ahead and got the next panel cut. What I did is, is see these lights right here? I had one that ran directly across. Well, what I did is I removed it and pushed it up. So now it's up there, out of the way. And now I got the tile cut, so I'm gonna sit the tile up in there. And then I use these um, screws and these wide spacers to anchor the styrofoam in them. And then once I get it anchored, I'll go back behind myself and put the foam on. So, yes, that's what we are going to do today. Get that done. Uh, try to get some other things done. I just finished the video about the cabinet. Check this out. Look at this. I added this little light here to it, right? So that way, if I need something over here, I can turn the light there. If I need something over here, I can turn the light there. And then the best part is, is if I can't find it, I can pick up the light and then I can use it like this. That's if I don't feel like turning on the RGB strip that's inside of it. Uh, so yeah, the weather today is not good. Um, as you can see, it is wet outside, which kind of ruined my plans to barbecue grill, and it ruined my plans to paint. I got this nice wooden thing. Uh, I'll show it to you right here. See, it's uh, it sits up against the wall. Hold on, I'm sorry. Anyway, it sits up against the wall like that. And then I can put things on top. Well, anyway, I had to paint it black. Of course, as soon as I go to paint it, guess what happens? It decides to rain, kind of like it is now. Um, so, all right, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get down to it. Here we go. When you're using this stuff, guys, don't touch your face or your hair or your mouth or nothing like that because your hand will stick to it and hair will get all over your hand. Don't pet your dog or cat. Don't do nothing with this stuff on your hands. Make sure you wash your hands after you're done playing with it. All right. you'll miss the foam sometimes so whatever you miss and it hits or lands on it's going to be sticky um, and you don't want that but a little bit of rubbing alcohol will make it come right off and then if you want to get the ceiling tiles off you use a blow dryer just take a regular blow dryer and just run it over the tile and you'll be able to peel it right off although if you put this on your wall there's a good chance that it will peel the paint too when you go to remove the tile. Okay, so there you have it. I hung a tile and then I put some other stuff or some other foam up. Now, 
these side pieces and stuff that kind of hang out once I'm done completely tiling the best I can then what I'll have to do is I'll have to start cutting these to fit and I just got to do the rest of the silver there in the back and then over here I'm not too worried about that because the camera angle stops right there where this foam is and the camera angle doesn't go any further but I would eventually like to do the whole thing in foam so that way no matter which angle the camera hits it doesn't appear as if I'm in a garage so I am already starting to achieve that with this look alone um, so far I don't know it's a few boxes uh, let's see here a hundred so far I'm at a hundred foam tiles and I got more to go so yeah one of the things that I managed to complete was the border you see remember it ended right there well I finished the rest of it and I think it looks great especially you know when you come down I'll see this side I came down but over here I put that black paneling there which I don't know do you guys like that I think it matches and I definitely like the acoustic decor and stuff and then that shelf I just showed y'all I'm gonna put that shelf right there but check this out up underneath here you got this little switch and BAM see that I put an LED light in here right there so that way when I'm back here working and doing things I can have a light because once all of this is done I gotta clean up all of this get this all out and get it straight it looks like my computer is ready to be turned on so let's do this next thing that I would like to do is take this and mount it right there so that way it fills in that void and hides that line the only thing is is the inside of it is hollow so I'm gonna have to put a piece of wood in it so that way I'll have something to anchor this to on the other side so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna set that here and try to find a piece of wood that will fit into that crack and then screw it from the bottom and then that way I'll be able to screw it into the back I need another person what happens is, is I try to put some weight to hold the shelf against the wall but when I'm driving the screw in there's not enough force to hold it so what happens is, is the screws just pushing the whole thing along and I mean what I need is I need somebody to physically hold it while I put the screw in or I can hold it and then the person can put the screws in I already have them marked and lined up I just I need to try to figure out a way of doing it couldn't hang the shelf so I moved on to this stuff and what I did is I hung it there that way it fills in that aluminum look you know you, it looks good especially when you're standing this way and you're filming it and stuff um, it looks good like that I like it it's starting to make the the area look complete okay so a couple of hours have gone by and I it came to me on how I can hang the shelf so what my idea was was to take a really long screw okay run the long screw through and have it come out the other side like that then take this metal thing and jam it up into it and push it back kind of like if you took a chair and you shoved it up against the door like you know where the doorknob is if you shoved a chair up against the doorknob you're not going to open the door it's the same concept so it pressed up against it and I was able to anchor some screws in it. Let's see if I was successful. Oh, it's holding. It's holding. Yeah, it's there. Does it look straight though? Yeah, it does. It does look fairly straight. If it ain't, then there ain't much I can do about that. Oh. All right, guys. 
I guess I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. I'm gonna go get some lunch. I'm hungry. I've been working out in this garage since nine o'clock this morning and I'm done for right now. I'm gonna take a break. Thank you so much for watching. Give me a like, leave a comment, and as always, you guys be cool.